is equal to 180 degrees times n minus 2. In this formula, Hi guys, it's me, Teacher Gon. In today's video, we will talk about the sum of interior angles of a polygon. So without further ado, let's do this topic. So what we have here is a table that we need to complete for the entire video and their regular polygon. So we have here the number of name of polygon, the number of sides na nawawala, and then yung ating sum of interior angles. So this is the first table from triangle up to decagon. So for us to complete this, we need to practice more on how to find the sum of the interior angles of this given figures or given polygon. First one is quadrilateral. We know that in a quadrilateral, this one is a polygon with four sides. So how are we going to find the sum of the interior angles? By the way, guys, when we say interior angles, we have here this angle, this angle, this angle, this angle. Since this one is a regular polygon, meaning all of the sides or all of the angles are congruent. So what we have here is to use the formula S is equal to 180 degrees times N minus 2. In this formula, S stands for the sum of the interior angles, while the letter N, it stands for the number of sides. Since this one is a quadrilateral, meaning the value of N is equal to 4. Now, how to use the formula? All we need to do is to plug in the value of N here, and it goes like this. We have 180 degrees times your N, which is 4. This N will become 4 minus 2. Simplify the parentheses. We have here 180 degrees times 4 minus 2, which is equal to 2. And as you can see, simplifying this part, 180 degrees times 2, that would be 360 degrees. And this is now the value of the sum of the interior angles of a quadrilateral. Later on, we will put this in a given table from the start of the video. Let's continue with the hexagon. When we say hexagon, this is a polygon with how many sides? Very good. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, meaning the value of n is equal to six. Now, we are ready to get the, the sum of the tier angles using the formula s is equal to 180 degrees times n minus 2. Let's plug in n, which is 6. That would be 6 minus 2. So we can simplify this part. This is 180 degrees. Then 6 minus 2, that would be 4. And now, here's the question. What is 180 degrees times 4? Okay, very good, guys. The correct answer is 720 degrees, meaning the sum of all six interior angles of a given regular hexagon is equal to 720 degrees. Now let's continue with the last one. We have here decagon. When we say decagon, it is a polygon with how many sides? 10 sides. So to use the formula, again, let me rewrite the formula. S is equal to 180 degrees times N minus 2. Plug in natin yung ating N, which is 10, minus 2. And now, as you can see, this is 180 degrees times 8. And what is 180 degrees times 8? The correct answer is 1,440. Meaning, in a regular decagon, the sum of all the interior angles 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 
return is equal to 1,440. Now guys, it's our turn to complete this table. So let me help you without uh, calculating each one of it. Okay? So let's continue with this one. Here, when you say triangle, it has three sides. And you need to remember that the sum of the three interior angles of a, rect of a triangle is always 180 degrees. Okay? Now, for the quadrilateral, this is 4. And then earlier, we have calculated that the value of S is 360. We have here 360 degrees. Next, what about pentagon? This is 5-sided regular polygon. Now, as for the sum of the interior angles, this is 540 degrees. And earlier, our 6-sided polygon, which is the hexagon, the value is 720 degrees. So we are done with triangle, quadrilateral, pentagon, and hexagon. Let's continue with the other table. We have here heptagon. When you say heptagon, guys, this is a seven-sided polygon. As for the sum of the interior angles, if you will use the formula, this will give you the answer of 900 degrees. Next, octagon, eight. The sum of the interior angles is 1,008 degrees. And now, we have the decagon, which is 10-sided polygon, and its sum of interior angles earlier is 1,440. Now guys, as you can see, iniwan ko yung nonagon. Ilang sides meron ng isang nonagon? And what is the sum of the interior angles of a given regular nonagon? So you guys, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the bell button for you to be updated sa ating latest uploads. And guys, don't forget to comment your answer about this question. Yun lang, paalam!